brakes screech, and smoke rises from beneath the tractor trailer's tires. That was the scene after a truck snagged a low-hanging thick section of tree near 12th Road. It had just dragged that huge limb down 14th Avenue in Whitestone Tuesday night. Go, 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 go. Over here! Stop this guy! Eric, who didn't want his last name used, saw the truck with a trailer owned by the company Extra head down his street with a chunk of tree sticking out both sides like a spear wedged between the cab and the trailer. So he jumped in his car and tried to stop the trucker. My concern was that he didn't try to get onto the Whitestone Bridge or one of the area bridges and drive with a tree branch sticking out of both sides and potentially do a whole lot more damage. After already damaging close to 20 cars. One one of the damaged cars was Eric. You can see all of the broken glass, the caved in metal from the impact of that tree and the truck. You can even see pieces of wood inside of the windshield, inside of the car itself. It was like a freight train coming down the street. Audrey Nealon's car smashed up too. You could hear all the crashing, all the neighbors, everybody came running out. Uh, it's unbelievable. Eventually, an MTA bridge officer pulled up next to the truck driver, stopping the carnage. Police think the whole thing was an accident, that the driver never even knew it was happening. But Nealon disagrees. I don't understand how he could not know that he had a tree on his truck. How could you not know that? She wants to know why he was on her street in the first place. Trucks are not allowed on most of the path of destruction. A lot of box trucks are coming by constantly and they know they shouldn't be on the block so they go speeding and though no one was injured tuesday she's worried the next truck problem could be deadly in the whitestone section of queens mark liverman cbs 2 news and police gave the driver summonses for leaving the scene of an accident and driving without headlights we reached out to the trucking company extra for comment so far no response